Thank you for joining. I hope that you are doing well. If you like potatoes, you should try sunchokes, a humble food with many benefits. The perennial Jerusalem artichoke, or sunchoke, is in the sunflower family and is native to eastern North America. It provides a long season of yellow three to five inch flowers on top of six to ten foot stems. In the ground, delicious edible tubers grow and can be harvested any time from late fall until the ground freezes. Similar in appearance to ginger root, the slightly sweet tubers have a nutty flavor that some compare to artichokes. They're delicious roasted, skin on, with a drizzle of olive oil. Sunchokes are high in iron and potassium and store carbohydrates as inulin, not starch. So they're a good alternative to potatoes. For people seeking a high fiber, non-starchy, diabetic friendly vegetable. Most of the carbohydrates in sunchokes are in the form of inulin. Inulin acts as a prebiotic providing a source of food for beneficial probiotic organisms in your body. Probiotics may help improve your immune function, produce vitamins, lower your cholesterol, and prevent disease-causing bacteria from multiplying. Consuming prebiotics may be an easier way to increase the probiotic organisms in your body than taking probiotic supplements because you don't have to worry about them surviving the digestive process, like you would with probiotics. But inulin does have one unfortunate downside. Consuming too much inulin, more than 10 grams a day, can make you gassy. Within 6 to 8 hours of eating the sunchokes, you'll know whether your body tolerates the inulin well or not. According to some experts, eating sunchokes after they have been stored or overwintered in ground, encourages the inulin to convert to sugar, thus eliminating gassiness. Fermenting the sunchokes may also eliminate this. As your body gets used to this new food, you may be able to increase how much you eat without the gassy side effects. Thank you for watching. Good day and good health.